Good morning, I'm Bradley Williams, Realtree Land Pro and owner of Buckhaven Land Solutions. Today we're out here at Ponderosa Farms in Heflin, Alabama, and we're going to be doing a little prescribed burning today. Uh, today's objective in this burn is to maintain our habitat for uh, bobwhite quail uh, and also in, uh, improve habitat for wild turkey and white-tailed deer as well. Um, it's April 16th, uh, we're getting to the beginning of the growing season. And uh, a lot of people don't like to use prescribed fire or they're worried about using it this close to nesting season for uh, your ground nesting birds. Um, but many studies have shown that when properly done, uh, the benefit of doing these burns to maintain that habitat far outweighs the potential nest destruction. And uh, typically the quail and the turkeys will actually re-nest and re-establish a lot of those nests that uh, may be damaged by the fire. Um, the, the things that this, this burning will accomplish is uh, really bringing back and maintaining that, that quality of uh, brooding and nesting cover for these birds. Uh, so stay tuned, hope you enjoy the video, and uh, like and subscribe to the, the channel and keep watching. Let it back about a chain and then we'll start. Do you want me to go down to that other end at the road and work back towards you? Uh, start heading down there while this is backing? Look down in that yeah. holler. I know, but it's oh, cooking. Look, at, look how far that fire is way up there. That's what I'm the saying. Ridge. That's what I'm I looking you were talking at. About uh -uh. Down in the uh -uh. I'm looking up there on the ridge. Yeah, that's like the That's huge. I love this stuff. Cooking them pines. Them little voluntary ones right there are gonna be toast. Yeah, that's what, that's what we want. That's what yeah, I think this is gonna be patchy enough the way we want it. Like it's it's ripping up, then dying down, then ripping up, then dying down. Uh, 
That's cool. so uh, this burn is completed uh, as you can tell from looking behind me uh, went really well uh, didn't have any spot overs or any incidents um, step aside here so you can see but uh, again we're managing this for quail and so what we did the way that we uh, fired this off and using the topography um, was we allowed some of the fire to rush up these slopes and then some of the slopes we fired it so the fire would back down in a less intense manner and as you can see behind me you can see some spots that are really burned out and some that are uh, still green and still are providing some good cover for the quail um, i like trying to leave a few islands within this so these quail still have some of uh, some escape cover from aerial predators um, so all in all i think the burn went really well today um, again, before you burn, it's really important to get the proper training and to uh, hire a uh, certified prescribed burn manager to make sure you get the end results that you're looking for and uh, have a safe and effective burn. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, like and subscribe to the channel and uh, have a good day.